Hi, Renee Hess here, founder and executive director of the Black Girl Hockey Club, and today I'm going to tell you a little bit about our October fundraiser. So first and foremost, Black Girl Hockey Club is a place where we support Black women in hockey. We do that with our programming. We have a scholarship program. In October 1st, we just announced 10 more scholarships to Black Girl Hockey players all over the world. We also have meetups where we get together, hang out, go see a hockey game, do some educational activities, maybe do some service in the community. And we just came off of a two-part virtual webinar that was meant for parents and students who are interested in going to hockey boarding schools. We're also planning a meetup in Pittsburgh, Go Pens, uh, coming up on October 20th, in which we're just going to get together, hang out, and go see a hockey game. Last season, we had 10 meetups in person, and we did two virtual meetups. We're already well on our way to a incredible hockey season. We also have our leadership and development program, and in the 2021-2022 season, we had nine mentees, and this was our first go-round. We're fundraising for all sorts of things, internal and external, including internal resources, infrastructure. We've got to pay Black women, and it starts with us. Last but not least, we have the Black Girl Hockey Club Get Uncomfortable Advocacy Campaign. And this season, we are launching our Get Uncomfortable Playbook. And this is with Black Rosie Media, led by Erica Ayala, a longtime friend of Black Girl Hockey Club and volunteer. I cannot wait for you to see what we have come up with in order for the hockey world to get uncomfortable. So if you can, please donate to Black Girl Hockey Club. You can visit our donate page on our website, go to the link tree in our profile bio and give what you can because we won't be able to do this without you.